Good morning, nursing students. <laughs> oh my gosh, it has been a minute. I passed my last exam for semester three on Friday. It is Sunday, the something of something. I am driving six hours to go to a rural placement for two weeks. And then I come home and have a further two weeks placement at my local hospital. And then I'm done, guys. I'm so excited. I have gotten fuel. My car is packed with things and whatever. And um, yeah. So I'm gonna try and vlog as much as I can and keep you guys updated. Um, I'm nervous. It is cold this morning and yeah. Hello, nursing students. Okay, um, I've just stopped. I've needed to go to the toilet. I am at need I am in a town called Bell, Queensland, um, which isn't too far away from where I live, but um, I have four and a half hours to go. Let's see how we go. So this is very exciting. Hi everyone, I'm still driving. Um, I'm definitely very remote and rural right now. I'm surrounded by trees and red dirt and wide open highways. Um, so yeah. Very interesting. I shouldn't be filming and driving, uh, but there's no cars around me, so I'm risking my own life, and that's it. Um, yeah, it's like the graveyard of dead kangaroos and tire rubber and red dirt. Crazy. So I've got 175 kilometers to go until I get there, uh, which is about an hour and 50 minutes. I've got one town in between me and my destination, so I'm gonna get some petrol or fuel um, and maybe get something to eat and just hang out for a little bit um, and then I'll drive the further hour to uh, Deer and Bandy which is where I'm going. So yes, I'm having a bit of a culture shock at the moment and I don't really know how to feel. Um, this two weeks of placement at the hospital is going to be very exciting. I um, hope I learn a lot and I hope they're really lovely. So I'll probably film when I get to Deer and Bandy and the nursing quarters. Okay, bye. gotten myself into it's um just so remote I just don't like you can see for miles it's crazy and there's just dead things everywhere dead animals all over the place so yeah I will be very much looking forward to having a shower and having a nap but I do have to unpack a lot of stuff I hope the nursing quarters are okay. I'm quite worried that they're gonna be really dirty and I'm gonna to have to give it a clean. Um, I think I just get a room and then I share the bathroom and the kitchen area with others, which is fine, but I'm an only child, so yeah. <laughs> okay, I'll update you guys later. Hi everyone, I am here. It is 6.40 now. It's been a long time since I updated. Okay, so. I've been put in the doctor's unit um, because I'm a male and all the nurses that are in the nurses accommodation are female so they thought it would be better to put me separate separate bathrooms and that kind of thing so I get a whole unit to myself <laughs> and it's really nice too um, I don't know how long I'm staying in this unit for though um, I might be shifted back over to the nursing quarters um, so yeah, I'll just enjoy it while I've got it, hey? Um, let me just do a quick tour for you.
Good morning, everybody. It is Monday the 5th. I think it's the 5th. Sorry. I'm just making a coffee. <clears throat> and I start at 7 o'clock this morning. So the hospital here in Durambendi currently has four patients and four of those patients are aged care patients. Good morning everyone, it is like 6.11 I think and I'm getting ready for day two of my rural or remote placement. I am tired, I know this is starting to get congested and yeah, so it's a very quiet hospital and I know I said the Q word um, but there's four aged care patients and that's it. Um, and then we just do triage to whoever comes through the door that needs help. So, um, yes, yesterday was interesting today. Hopefully we get something. Um, but yeah, I'll be sure to keep you guys updated. Bye. Hey everybody, I just wanted to add this little audio clip in here. So basically I didn't film a lot of my experience out in Deer and Bandy. Um, it was very quiet, um, but I'll just read out some of the reflections that I wrote down of things that I got to see while I was out there. Um, so I got to uh, care for a patient that was um, experiencing drug withdrawal. Um, got to give antibiotics and got to help a patient that was admitted with chest pain, remove sutures from somebody's back. Um, got to assist the uh, medical officer uh, relocate like an elbow, that was fun. And yeah, so I did have an amazing experience out in Durand Bandy. It was a bit scary and different for me, um, but you definitely have to be well versed and very trained to be out there to be able to deal with anything that walks through the door. So yeah. Hi everybody, it is Jack here. It is the 11th of August. It is 12.49. I'm still on my rural prac. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna go for a drive now. I need to find some wireless internet so that I can update my phone because it's playing up. And there's, there's wireless internet here at the hospital, but it's really slow. So apparently there's like a Telstra Air hotspot about an hour away. So I'm gonna take a drive there and see if I can get some internet so I can update my phone. So yes. Good morning, everybody. It is 5.48 in the morning. It is Monday morning. Uh, I don't know what the date is. I don't know what the date is. Fuck, I'm tired. As you can tell by the last clip, I was getting pretty tired towards the end of the week. I started doing 12 hour days so that I could leave two days early. Um, so I was absolutely buggered. <laughs> All of the staff out there, all the nursing staff, the doctor that was out there, all of the operational staff were super lovely and welcoming to have um, me out there. Um, so yeah, um, that's pretty much all for the video guys. I've just got some clips that I filmed around the hospital grounds um, that I've inserted here. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Sorry it's not that interesting, but if you like, make sure you leave a comment and uh, like the video. Let me know what else you'd like to see. Currently I'm on a placement at my local hospital and I've almost finished my diploma. So that is very exciting. Um, I will be sure to make an update video in the near future. Thanks for watching.